Hey guys, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to add a forum to your website using BBPress. So if this is something you'd like to learn how to do, then watch this video. Okay, so we'll be using the BBPress plugin in order to create a forum in our WordPress website. So we'll be using just this blank WordPress install. So this will be useful in your business if you want to create like a help section or a support section within your website so people can come in and ask a question and your support reps can answer those questions. So it could be like for a software business, or even if you're building a community, say if you're a gym or a yoga studio, then you can create a forum. So members or those interested can ask questions and post content. So first you'll need to have a WordPress website. So I have other videos on how to do that if you don't have one yet. So what you wanna do is go into your dashboard Okay, go into plugins and add new. Okay, and we're gonna search BB Press. And then install now. Activate. Okay, and then we have it here activated. So let's just refresh so we can get some of the new features. So go to home. And then over here, now we have our forums available. So we have forums, topics, replies. And then over here in settings, we have this forum tab as well. Okay, so what you wanna do first is over here in your forum settings. So you can check over here. So people that register will be a participant. So you can see what's available here. So participants are those who can view and post replies, but they can't create new, say, topics, like new groups. So I think just having it by default with participant is essential. Okay, and then what you wanna make sure is that you allow registration on the site, so this will work. So go into general, and then over here, you wanna make sure this is on. Anyone can register and just make sure they're a subscriber because if you make them something else, then they can edit your site outside of BBPress. So make sure this is really important that you double check this and then click save. Okay, great. So now let's create our first forum. So go into create new forum. Let's just call this introductions. Okay, and then you have over here, what is this a forum or a category? So we'll just say it's a forum. And then you can say if it's a private group or public, so you can do that here. And if you're doing like subcategories, then you can do that here and then the order. And then if you have any moderators, so that's those who can delete and edit content. So you can do that there. Okay, so we'll click publish. Okay, and then next let's create a topic. So go into create new topic. So this will be under introductions. Let's just say this is for a gym. So let's say we can do say the a Toronto branch of the Toronto branch, and then this will be under the introductions. Okay, and then we can publish that. Okay, and then let's do another one. Let's say Vancouver. And then the same. Okay, and then let's create a page for our forum. So let's go to add new page and then just call this forum. Okay, and publish. Okay, and then next what you wanna do is look here into short codes, and then you can get all the necessary short codes for BBPress. So we wanna display this for all our forums. So it'll be here. So it'll just be the index, and then we can paste that like that. And then save yeah, and view the page. Okay, great. So we have our forum over here on this page. So I'll just make another forum. So go here into forums and then create new forum. So this one will be called support. Okay, let's make this one a category. Okay, and then make it the second one. So this is a forum. This is a Category for support questions. Okay, publish. 
Okay, and back into our form. Okay, so we have this one here. This is a category for support QA. If you're having issues with the plugin, then we need to install this BBP style pack. So go to add new plugin and search BBP style pack. Yep, so this one over here. Okay, and then install. Okay, go into settings. Okay, and then now we need to enable enable the basic support. Okay, and then save that. Okay, and then visit the site. Go here into forum. And then introductions. Awesome. So this is now showing. So again, if you have a more modern theme, then BB Press might not work. So if you're having issues like we were having last time with, with the forum not showing, then you can install that plugin. Okay, and then now we can go into our topics here. And there we go. So you can add a new topic. So say, looking for gym buddy. I work out between 7 to 8 a.m. Okay, and then tag gym buddy. And then down here, you can notify if someone gives you a reply. So submit that. Okay, and then if we go back here in our introductions, now we have a new post and we can see that over here and then you can go in there and then you can see the latest replies to the post here okay great so lastly i'm just going to add some links to our navigation such as uh, login and register so people can make edits to the forum so go here into appearances okay and then we need to create the pages. So let's just do go page and add new. And then we can check our short codes here. So we have our login, register, and lost password. So I we'll just create those three pages. Oops. So this one is login. And then you wanna take that, okay. And then you wanna take the short code and then publish. I'll add another page. So I'll add the register. Oops. So over here, and then this one was register. Okay, and then you can go back to our dashboard. Okay, and then back in our dashboard, let's go into editor. Okay, and then here in navigation, oops, so just need to click around here. So yeah, so it's already up here added. So let me just edit that here so we can remove ones that we don't need. So say sample page, we don't need that. Introductions, we don't need that. Okay, and then we can save this and then view the site. Okay, so we can log in here. Okay, so I'm already logged in and then register. So again, I'm already logged in. So wait, let me just log out first. Okay, so just log out. Okay, great, so now we can register here. And then you can log in. So great, so we were able to set up a forum directly in our WordPress website. So this is beneficial. So you're able to communicate with your clients and customers. So this includes the end of the video. I hope you're able to follow along and add a forum to your website. If you need help with anything on your website, then you can contact me at maplitmedia.ca. Please like and subscribe to stay up to date on my latest videos and thanks for watching.